I'm Olivia De Silva with the Investing News Network, and I'm here to give you your monthly base metals update. Taking center stage for the second month in a row is Vail. Over the past month, the company has been forced to pause operations at several of its mines. While the company just received permission last week to reopen its Burkutu mine, celebration was cut short on Monday when fresh court orders forced the company to pause operations at 13 of its dams. The company's up and down news sent iron ore prices skyrocketing and scrambling throughout the month as the market reacted to the game of supply and demand. The copper scene has been ripe with junior and major minor crossovers over the past month, including Ares Resources, which put forward a $575 million bid for Glencore's CSA mine in Australia. Also around the same time was mining giant BHP, who went in on a letter of intent with Luminex Resources for its Tarkey copper concessions in Ecuador. As of March 25th, the red metal was trading at $6,327 per tonne on the London Metal Exchange. In zinc news, Vedanta Zinc International's refinery in Namibia is currently on a five-week shutdown after miners went on strike near the end of February. While Vedanta's Scorpion refinery continued to operate, it depleted its ore supplies and actually led to the shutdown as the supplies needed to be replenished. To wrap up zinc, Wood Mackenzie senior research analyst Rory Townsend told INN at PDAC that the consultancy predicted zinc prices peaking at $3,700 per ton this year. As of March 25th, zinc was trading at $2,838 on the London Metal Exchange. That's everything we have for this month, but be sure to stay in the loop by checking us out on Facebook, LinkedIn, and Twitter.